Today I was in Bloxburg playing games with my friend when my mean brother barged in and took over the TV. That made me really mad since he's always ruining the fun. So I need to come up with a way to make sure he can never do that again. Jake said, go away, stinky girls. I'm playing games? Uh, I was literally playing games first with my friend that I invited over. I am going to kick your butt. What the? Why, why are you crying? He said, mom. Don't want to get grounded. Ugh. Ugh. Fine. Use it, Jake. Gosh. I literally can't do anything with my little brother around. He always just starts crying the second I tell him no. Oh, this is so frustrating. Madison said, what if we move the switch into your room? No, that won't work because he will just come get it or a little demon will steal it in the middle of the night or something. Oh, I don't know what I'm going to do. If it's anywhere in plain sight, he's just gonna find a way to get it and cry if I try and take it away. Madison said, oh, I have an idea. She said, what if you figure out a way to hide it from him and put it somewhere only we can use? <gasps> that is a perfect idea, yes! Yes, I know exactly what I'm going to do because Jake is leaving for a sleepover tonight, which gives me the perfect amount of time to build a super secret gaming room that only we know about. Okay, guys, my mom and my little brother are about to leave right now to take Jake to his sleepover. So it's about time to put my game plan into action. Mom said, I'll be back soon, Carrie. Don't burn down the house. Uh, as if I would, I am responsible. Jake said, Mom, she's dumb. She might burn down the city. Okay, whatever. Just go to your little sleepover, Jake. He won't be able to bother me anymore once I have my super secret hideout. Okay, there they go, there they go. So long, little brother. See you never in my little game room. It is time to start building. Okay, you guys, I am going to start working super quickly because I'm not exactly sure when my mom's supposed to be home. And I have a feeling she's not gonna be super excited about me building a secret gaming room to hide from my brother. So I'm gonna keep it from her too. I have built this little empty room right over here. So the first thing I have got to do is put a secret door. I'm actually gonna kind of put it behind this plant. It's not gonna look perfect, but honestly, my brother's not very smart. So I think it'll look fine. But we're gonna paint that exactly like the wall. Perfect. All right, there we go. Now I have a door into my secret gaming room. And just because I'm working pretty quickly here, I'm gonna go ahead and move all of the gaming consoles into my room. And I'm just going to stick them in here for the time being. Boom, boom, boom. There we go. Okay, okay. Now I can really start decorating now that everything is out of the living room. All right, so first thing I gotta do is make this room super, super comfortable. So I'm going to actually use a bunch of these chairs to make one ginormous couch for me and Madison to use. And we're gonna add a couple of beanbag chairs. Now I'm going to make a little stand for all the gaming things. And now time to put a ginormous TV. It's going to be even bigger than the TV downstairs. Here we go. We're scrolling all the way down. Where's the biggest TV? Ooh, I could do a crazy projector. That would be cool. I think I'm going to do it. Oh, heck yeah. Okay, we've got the little projector all set. Oh my gosh, this is gonna be so awesome. This place is already coming along and I am so hyped right now. Uh oh, <laughs> guys, guys, guys. My mom just texted me and said she's on the way home. I have got to get out of build mode fast. Like normal, like normal, like normal, like normal. Okay, okay, hold on, hold on. Let me just get a glass of milk over here. Ha ha ha. No, no, no. Oh, mom, mom, hi. Don't mind me, just uh, drinking a glass of milk in the kitchen. Nothing going on over here, nothing suspicious. He said, I'm home, Carrie. Are you hiding something from me? Guys, what the heck? Nope, I sure am not. Uh, what a what a crazy question. <laughs> no, I'm not hiding anything. She said, hmm, okay, well, I'm about to go run some errands. Want to come with? Wait, guys, this is perfect. My mom's going to be out of the house, and I totally need some more time to work on this gaming room. I'm just going to say, uh, no thanks. I need time to... I need time to study. Yeah, yeah, real good quiet time alone at the house. No one else here to study. He said, okay, I'll be back later tonight. Enjoy time home without your brother. Ha <laughs> sure. Guys, I'm gonna have so much time without my brother when I finish my super secret room. 
All right, all right, all right. There goes my mom. Come on, just wait for her to leave. It is back into build mode. Here we go, here we go. All right, you guys, I have got quite a few hours to try and finish this. And I'm going to try and make this place so cool that even if Jake could see it, he would be so jealous. Okay, okay. I've got kind of the basics here. One more thing I am gonna add though is a little rug. Oh my gosh, a heart-shaped mat. <gasps> All right, now I'm going to start adding my colors. And because it is just for me and Madison, I'm picking the colors I want. And that color would be pink. And then I'll do pink lights. But do I want a pattern? Do I want a wallpaper? Do I want to get crazy? I think I do. Oh, do I want jungle leaves or zebra? I think I'm feeling jungle leaves. Whoa, okay, okay, that is cool. I'm digging it, boom. Okay, room is pink. I'm gonna go ahead and do this carpet. I'm gonna make this carpet a really dark purpley color. What should I do that? I kinda like that. Persimmon? I don't even know what that is. What's a persimmon? Doo -doo -doo. Now let's do the floor. I think I want carpet on the floor because this room does have to be secret. That means it needs to be pretty soundproofed and carpet is way better for that. All right, now the couch. I'm actually going to leave white, but I'm going to change the pillow colors to pink. We're doing pink, blue, and green. That's the vibe. Pink, purple, and green. No, all the colors. Any colors I want, because it's my game room. And I'm gonna pick a fun material for my coffee table. Ooh, water. Oh, wait, that is such a cool coffee table. What the heck? I love that. I'm gonna make these a little bit of a brighter pink just because it is right on the floor. And I'm gonna keep the edges. Like, go back here. I'm gonna see if I can do this one, the watery texture. I can, it matches the coffee table now. Look at that. Okay, y'all know we already gotta add these heart lights. Okay, okay, here we go. And we're gonna have some little wall lamp. And y'all know we gotta be putting lava lamps. You already know, here we go. Get a cool, funky lava lamp. Oh, I'm already obsessed. And ambiance, we've gotta have candles, okay? I cannot decorate a room without a candle. We'll just get a little simplicity table. Boom, right here, boom, right here. And now when you're sitting on the couch, on the edges, no problemo. Now, to make this room even better, we are going to need some mini fridges. Oh, no. oh, we're definitely gonna need some music. All right, guys, you already know we gotta have surround sound. We are not skimping in this room. Oh my God, a disco ball? Oh yeah, absolutely, that is so fun. Okay, I'm living for that. It's too bright to see right in this very moment but I'm living for it. And we cannot have a gaming room without some old fashioned arcade games. So, okay, we got an arcade game, looking good. Oh yeah, snacks, we need snacks. Yes, we are going to need lots and lots of snacks. All right, we've got it, we've got it. And now we've got to do the lighting. Obviously, we have got to add some neon lights. Okay, I don't want to add too many of these because I did add a disco ball and uh, I feel like the disco ball is definitely going to kind of take over. And okay, last thing before we add all of our colors, let me double check that there's no other lights I want to put in here. All right, now I'm going to add a couple of shelves and some decorations. All right, guys, I've got some shelves and now I'm going to add some decorations to that. I've changed all the colors, add a couple of posters, and then I think we will be done. Okay, fun, fun, fun. The colors are here, the colors are here. I'm living for it. This is so fun. Okay, I just have to fix the roof and do one more thing. Okay, 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 time to see the final product. Yes, yes, oh my gosh, you guys, it is done. I have got all the games over here. I've got sparkles, I've got snacks, I've got drinks. I have got everything you could possibly need. This is so cool. Now, when Jake comes home tomorrow, it will be the real test to see if this place is actually secret. All right, guys, it is the next morning and my mom is about to leave to go pick up Jake. There she is. She said breakfast is in the fridge. I'll be back soon with Jake, your brother. Okay. All right, all right, all right. She just has to head out. Here we go. I'm gonna shut the door behind her and Madison should be here any second to come hide in the secret room with me. I just have to wait for her to show up. Oh, she just knocked on the door. She just knocked on the door. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, I'm Madison. I am so excited to show her this. She said, Psst, I'm here. Uh, my mom is gone, so follow me. Okay, we do not have long before she's back with Jake. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay, okay, are you ready for this? Are you ready for this? <laughs> secret door, secret door. What do you think? She said, oh my gosh, this is so cool and so secret. I know, I messed up the roof a little bit, 
but we won't talk about it. It's literally fine. Whatever. I am so excited about this one. We're gonna play so many games and hopefully Jake doesn't find it. Okay, you guys, it has been a while now since my mom has been gone, so Jake should be back any second now. And, oh, oh, wait, wait, wait. I think I hear a car pulling up in the driveway. Okay, okay. I'm just gonna keep an eye on chat. We are going to hang out in here and see. Oh, Jake just said in chat, woo, time to play some video games. We are gonna see how he reacts to not being able to play his games because they are clearly all right here. All right, I can see their usernames. Oh, I see Jake. Oh, he must be in the room. He said, huh, mom, where's my video games? They're gone. Oh gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Madison said he's so angry. <laughs> My mom said, hmm, I'm not sure, Jake. Does Carrie know where they are? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I can kind of see his username. I'm gonna go way back here so he can't see mine. Oh, I see his username. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, okay. Okay, you know what, you guys? I'm gonna go into free camp and I'm gonna see if I can just spy on him a little bit. All right, where is he? Where is he? Oh, there he is, there he is. He said, Carrie, where's the switch? Ugh, it's not here. He immediately went to go to mom room. I knew he would try and steal my stuff if I put it in there. Oh no, he's coming by the he's coming by the door. He said she's not in her room. <gasps> there he goes. Okay, he's going to his room. Oh my gosh, he is so close to the secret door right now. He is literally so close. He said, mom, I can't find her. He is walking right past the secret door. He doesn't see it. He just said, oh, guys, I think he gave up. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, he didn't find it. <laughs> okay, he definitely didn't find the place, but I do have to go down there and reveal myself before he starts to get suspicious because I am supposed to be home right now. So if I want to keep up the act, I can't be in here for too long. I'm just going to step out really quick. Here we go. Here we go. Madison said, good luck. All right, all right there's Jake. I'm going to say, hey guys, what was all the yelling about? I was just in the restroom. Jake said, Carrie, what the heck? Where are the games? Actually, um, I sold them because I was too distracted and couldn't study. Sorry, I guess you can't play them anymore. I said, what, no! Oh my gosh, clearly mom's not too mad. She just said, oh, you kids. Jake said, this is the worst day of my life. Holy cow, okay, Jake is clearly very upset, but that should teach him a lesson. <laughs> and nobody knows about my secret gaming. Uh-oh. My mom just whispered to me and said, you better keep that secret gaming room clean. Oh my God. Okay, my mom's scary motherly instincts did step in, I guess, but hey, at least she didn't rat me out to my brother. I guess moms do know everything. That's freaky. Today I was in Bloxburg at my boyfriend Dylan's house. He was playing video games and wouldn't let me play at all. He even said I couldn't play because I was bad. This made me mad, so guys, I gotta do something about it. Dylan, can I have a turn on the PS5? No, okay? I do not want you messing up my game. You are literally going to die 24-7. Uh, cap. Big, uh, big uh, capper. Actually, I need to go to the bathroom right now. Do not touch my game. Uh, okay? Fine, whatever. I'm even gonna turn off the TV. Don't uh, touch my game. Oh my gosh. Guys, what was that? Dylan wouldn't let me play the game at all. And honestly, I'm kind of annoyed about it. And I think I want to do something about it. And I have a perfect idea. But first, I need to get Dylan off of the computer in real life. I'm back. Oh, oh, he's back. Ooh. I'm gonna unmute. I'm gonna unmute. It's, hey, it's hey. In there. Oh, you touched my game? You look suspicious. No, I didn't touch your game. Okay, well, um, don't go in the bathroom because it stinks in there. Gross. Oh, oh, would you go get me Chick-fil-A, please? Wait, like in real life or do you want me to go to like the town? No, I want you to get me Chick-fil-A in real life. What? Please, I told you if I don't get filled with Chick-fil-A right now, okay, I'm gonna okay. scream. Okay, I'm logging out. Okay, okay, I will be back. Bye. Okay, thank you. All right, perfect, you guys. Dylan just logged out and now it is time for me to get started. Okay, guys, so I am actually on Dylan's account right now and while he is out getting me food, I am going to build a super secret gaming room right in his house that he won't even know about and I can play all the video games I want. So the first thing I am going to do is I'm gonna go ahead and go in his room and grab his switch. I already know exactly where I'm gonna put this little secret spot. I'm gonna put it right here. There was a little crevice. So I'm gonna go ahead and just move these gaming things. And I'm gonna take them downstairs to my new gaming room. And then he can't tell me not to play them anymore. Dylan is gonna freak 
out when he gets into his room though and sees that all of his games are totally gone. Okay, this is going to be the absolute coolest gaming room ever. And I even have a couple of custom items that I'm thinking about trying to make. First things first though, because it's my room, I'm gonna decorate it however I want to. We're gonna, ooh, I like that color. We'll do a little pink room. And actually I should probably go ahead and add a secret door right here. Come on, wait, no, no, no. There's gotta be a place for this door to fit. Maybe I'll just move everything over a little bit and maybe then he won't even notice. All right, let's see if it'll work now. Yes! Okay, I'm gonna put that door right there. Go ahead and paint it the same color as this. There we go, he won't notice a thing. Okay, and then on this side, there we go. All right, now it is pink and it's flush with my wall. Maybe I'll make it a little bit darker pink just so I know where it is in the room. Okay, yeah. Yeah, we'll just do a little, little tiny little pink door right there. All right, guys. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to add a really, really big TV so that I can play games if I want to play on the console or I can play on the computer. I'm also going to add a little desk here. If this was Dylan's gaming room, he would have a big, giant gaming desk, but I don't want that. I want a cute little table just for me, like this one. And then we'll just go back to electronics. I'm about to pick out the coolest. Oh, I need more box bugs. Okay, you know what? Fine. I'm gonna get as many as I want to, so I'm gonna have as many monitors as I want. Now I have got my computer. Haha, <laughs> nice. I need just a cute little chip. Perfect, that is cute. Let's see, now I'm gonna add, I'm gonna paint my floor. Guys, you know we gotta add pink wall sconces, come on. Or, or even better, a lava lamp, oh yeah. All right, you guys, I have got the whole little gaming area over here mostly set up. I'm going to try to change the color of the TV really quick. And I'm actually gonna have to work pretty fast here because I don't know how long it's gonna take Dylan to go to Chick-fil-A, they are pretty snappy at the Chick-fil-A drive-thru. I am gonna have to, Oh gosh, guys. Guys, I just got a text. Dylan is on his way back right now. I have got to get the heck off this account. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Where the heck is my okay, PS5? Okay, guys, I am still muted on Discord and Dylan is looking for his PS5 right now. I'm gonna go ahead and unmute and just play dumb. Oh, oh my god. Hey, Dylan, God. sorry, I was on my phone. What's up? Are you okay? What? No, my games are gone. Uh, well, that's strange. Did you misplace them or move them somewhere? Carrie, how was that? I literally was offline at getting you Chick-fil-A. Mm. How did I misplace? It. That's, yeah, that's very strange. I don't know what you did with it. What? I don't know. Okay, you know what? Hold on. Let me go. Let me go look downstairs. I am so freaking confused. Okay, guys. I Where just is my stuff? again on Discord. Oh my gosh. Okay, I need to get Dylan to leave the house again, though, so I can go ahead and finish the room, and I already have a plan. Okay, guys. So I'm going to go ahead and whisper to Pat and say, uh... Okay, the games aren't downstairs. Oh gosh, Dylan's back. Dylan's oh back. Dylan's my back. god. Meeting. Where's my stuff, dude? I, I, I don't know. That's so strange. I, 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 why, I haven't why, seen why, it. Why are you, why are you talking like that? I'm not talking like anything. What do you, what do you mean? Oh, oh, hey, do you hear that? That's Pat, Pat, what are you working for? Oh, there Wait. he is. What? You know what? It must be time for his walk. Can you take Pat on his walk, actually? I'm clearly doing something. Please. I am looking for my... I walked him yesterday, a really long walk. He's been real crazy lately. He's oh, got to get some my. energy out. Uh, okay, fine. Pat, come on, let's go. Thank you. Make sure you walk him all the way to Look, Mountainside. Hey, well, I'm gone. Look for my games. Yeah, yeah, and yeah, don't, yeah, yeah. But don't play them. I wouldn't dream of it. Okay, come on, Pat, let's go. Move it, buddy. Come on. Right, let's move ya. it. Let's move it. Move it, move it, move it. Now it is time to add some more shelving and decorations. Actually, I'm gonna add some decorations and then I'm gonna add myself some little amenities. Let's add some boxes so I have storage for all of my gaming accessories. Okay, it's like a little, little pyramid. Oh, that is cute with the blue in the background. <gasps> Okay, we'll get some little pink boxes. Now I'm gonna add some little decorations. And guys, you know we're gonna need some house plants. Cause I'm gonna be spending a lot of time in here. You need that extra oxygen happening. I love this plant. I think it is so cute. And a little cactus. I want this to be like my little, little sanctuary. And because I'm a smart girl, writing books. All right, what do we got, guys? I haven't scrolled through this catalog in a while. I'm gonna add some hearts. Oh my gosh, yes. Okay, heart going right up there. Boom, boom, right there, perfect. All of our little plants are all matchy matchy. We're gonna paint these books. We have to make them all correspond with the colors of the room, obviously. Boom. 
boom, 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 There we go. Oh, it's cute, it's cute, it's cute, it's cute. It's giving mermaid room. Here we go, let me think, let me think, let me think. So the custom item that I wanna be doing is gonna kind of take up a lot of room right here. So what I'm going to do is I'm gonna add this. I feel like there's a smaller one. Mini? No mini fridge, okay. Okay guys, unfortunately I cannot fit the refrigerator in here with the custom item that I want to make later on. So that's fine, I have a different concept that I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna make myself a little coffee bar. We'll do it right here. As soon as you walk in, coffee bar. Now I need to add some cups for myself. So we are always prepared. And I'm gonna add one more shelf to hold all my coffee and tea and all the things that I want. Okay, yeah, we're good, we're good, we're good. Got some little jars up there, okay, and then we're getting earthy over here. I'm actually gonna put this here. There we go. Now those are fitting. Are they peeking through the wall? No. We're good. So cute. And these, we will make the purple color. Yeah, that is a cool coffee bar. But these aren't really matching anymore. A light blue as well. Yeah, there we go. Can I have a little coffee bar? Oh my god, I love it. Okay, okay, okay. And, um, ooh, that stuff looks really big. All right, you guys, here we go. Now I'm gonna need some speakers. Y'all know in my gaming room, we are having surround sound. So I am speaking. I am the coolest and you know what just cuz I'm gonna even get some really big ones right here so the first thing I'm gonna do <gasps> oh 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 Pat just whispered to me Pat just whispered to me that means they must be on their way back from their walk okay I have got to get out of build mode but I still need to finish this room so I'm gonna have to find another way to get Dylan to leave all right guys Dylan and Pat should be back from their walk pretty soon and I think I have another way to get Dylan out of the house. They should be in here any I'm second. I'm back. Oh, guys, I'm Carrie, I'm where are you? Uh, hey, hey, Dylan. How was the walk? What are you doing in the kitchen? I thought you were supposed oh, to look for my games. Well, oh my gosh, you'll never believe it. I ate an entire not, bag I, of Takis. I, and my I, I, I believe that. really hurts. I know. I, I really believe that. So, like, really bad. I was wondering if you could go get me some medicine from the store. Wait, what? From my I stomach. I just walked Pat, and I had to carry him because he was being psycho. Well, I told and you he's been like that lately. Yeah, but... Please, wait, you want, please, you want, like, real, please, please. You want, you, like, real medicine? Yes, like, real, real like life from CBS? medicine. Yes. Why didn't you ask me that when I was getting you chicken? Because it didn't start hurting until just now when you walk through the door, and if I don't get medicine, I'm gonna throw up. Okay, just text me what you need me to get from CVS. Okay, okay thank you. Bye, I'll be back. Okay, okay guys, I think that finally did it and Dylan did not log out. So that means that I can continue to work on this build and I should have quite a while now so I can work on those custom items I was talking about. Okay, first things first is I'm going to add the rug. It's gonna be a little off center, but I kind of want it to be like right here. Here we go, guys. It's gonna be a little flower and it's gonna be so cute. Here we go, purple petals. In the middle, we're gonna make it blue. Ooh, with this like blue green. <gasps> That is kind of cute. Okay, but the material is not working for me. Let's see, let's do an oceany blue. Oh my God, wait, how cute is that? Okay, very cute. And for this, sand. We'll make it purple sand cute. Oh my gosh, you guys, look at my little flower rug. Ah! I am going to make a big giant day bed somewhere between a couch and a bed so that while I'm sitting over here, playing my video games. I can be very comfortable and cozy in my little bed and there's room for Pat because Pat's been helping me out. So that means Pat gets a spot in the secret gaming room. All right, you guys, I've got this. I am zooming, I am moving. I am not as fast as I want to be, but I'm, I'm okay. And this is going to be so worth it because this is gonna be way comfier than just a regular old couch. We'll fit right in here. Yes. I knew this one was gonna be difficult, you guys. I really knew it. Okay, I'm gonna delete this one now. Yes, okay, good, 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 good. Now let's move the bed in here. All right, you guys, it's happening, it's happening. Everything is happening. This isn't perfect yet. I've never been so focused in my life. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. I am, I'm on, I'm zoned in. There we go. Okay, okay, day bed, day bed, day bed. There we go, next steps. All right, you guys, now I'm going to move. Oh, no, 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 not you. You're not moving. I'm gonna move this. <gasps> yes, okay, 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 okay. 
Okay, now we're gonna add what looks like some little boxes. Boom, boom, we'll make them a little longer, that's okay. All right, I've got little boxes, and now I'm gonna get more things. It's gonna look crazy at first, but just, you know, give me trust, and you you guys already know. Look at these, don't these pillow, doesn't this pillow match the rug? I'm obsessed. Okay, and I'm gonna paint it the colors that it needs to be. This will go right front and center. You guys know I need all the pillows. All right, we got a bunch of pillows. Now I'm just gonna change the sizes of these for ultimate coziness. Now I'm actually going to go ahead and add a little, I don't know if I like this little indent right here. There we go. Okay, now it is a full day bed, okay. I'm gonna do some colors to it. Oh, cute, cute, cute. Wait, I have one more thing I need to do. One more thing, I almost forgot corner blanket over here and a little corner blanket. Cute. Let's paint some things. All right, this. Oh yeah, but then the center part, you know what I'm already doing. You already know. Green material. We're gonna make it the ocean material so it totally matches. Oh heck to the yeah, you guys. All right, these pillows are going with this and we're going to give it a purple rim. All right, we're also going to do these in pink. I'm gonna go ahead and change the color of the bed. Oh my God, it already did it for me. Okay, I'm adding these. We're gonna make these light blue. Actually, let's do the bluish green color. There we go. Make this also blue green. <gasps> yes! Oh my goodness, you guys, this is it. This is the moment. This is it. Oh, that is so cute. Okay, this is too cool. I'm almost sad that Dylan doesn't get to be in here because it is so cute. Okay, I just have a few more things I need to do. Oh gosh. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Guys, guys, Dylan's FaceTiming me. He's FaceTiming me right now. Yo. Uh, hey, hey. Yo. My stomach still hurts so bad. I, I, I know, I'm almost out. Okay, okay. Are you on the toilet? Y yes, I'm on the toilet. Why are your headphones on? So I don't have to listen to it. That's just, okay, bye. Bye. Okay, 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 you guys. I have got to speedy fast go through this. The last thing I have to do is just add a little bit of lighting and then we are done. So I'm gonna add, I want it to be vibey. Guys, I'm trying to go so fast right now, you have no idea. Okay, okay, now I just have to add colors. We'll do it, ooh, that's too light, that's too bright, that's too bright, okay. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, wait, guys, 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 guys. I think I have myself a little gaming room, how? Okay guys, Dylan just came in here and gave me my medicine and then he's going back to his room right now. So it is time for me to go hide. I am still muted on Discord. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I am so excited. Honestly, I probably should have added a little more lighting. Yo, I'm back. Hello? Guys, I hear Dylan, but I'm still muted. He doesn't know where I Gary? am right now. Yo, where the heck are you? What? Why are you muted on Discord? What the heck? <laughs> where? Gary, where Gary, are you? He has no idea Yo. where I am. Where are my games still? Okay, so the I'm so confused. is definitely working. This is what he gets for being mean to me and not letting me play his games. Here we go, you guys. Oh what? my gosh, you guys, look at me. <laughs> oh, okay, guys, so I can only use the gaming room when Dylan's online. I didn't think about that. Oops. Today I was at school in Bloxburg playing video games with my friend during lunchtime when suddenly our teacher appeared and started roasting us. She called us stupid for playing video games and that only dumb people played games. What the heck? I cannot believe Miss Needs is being so mean right now. I'm just gonna say, uh, we're allowed to play during lunch. We're not in a class or anything. She just said, I don't care. Both of you are never going anywhere in life if you keep playing video games. So throw them away? Uh, what the heck? That is so mean. She's literally being horrible for no reason. We pay attention in class and we play games on our break. What's so wrong with that? I'm just gonna say she's the worst. Maddie said, literally, if only there was a way to play video games without her seeing us. She said, I just need a break from studying so much. I'm gonna say, yeah, me too, but I don't know how we would ever do that without getting in trouble. Wait, wait, guys, I have an awesome idea. I'm gonna say, we can totally secretly play games without Misty noticing if we have a secret gaming room in the school. We just have to build it. She said, oh, that's a great idea, Carrie. But one problem, she said, we can't build during the day. We're gonna need build mode and access to the school at night. The only way we can pull this off is by stealing the keys from the 
principal, and then we'll have access to the school at night. Maddie said, ha ha, you're crazy, but I am so in. All right, you guys, it's a plan. We are building a secret gaming room. Okay, guys, we are outside of the principal's office right now, and he is sitting at his desk right now. The plan is, is for Maddie to go in there, cause a distraction, and then I run in, grab the keys off of his desk that he will hopefully leave there. Oh, Maddie just said, I am so ready for this. I love going crazy. Oh, I'm just gonna say, uh, ha ha, okay, you guys. I don't know what Maddie is planning, but whatever it is, as long as it distracts Principal Smarty, I don't care. Oh, she said, go time. Oh, there she goes, there she goes. Oh my gosh. Okay, guys, she just barged right into his office. Uh, Principal Smarty said, hello, do you need something, miss? Maddie said, you look so Stupid, Principal Smarty. Wait, oh my gosh, guys, I didn't expect that to be the distraction. She said your hair is so greasy and gross, like, ew. Guys, she's being so mean. I thought she was just gonna say there was like an emergency in the bathroom or something. She said, go take a shower or something. Guys, this is way too far for just a distraction, but okay. She said, you smell too. And Principal Smarty said, excuse me? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, this is bad. Oh, he got up from his desk. Oh, she said, stinking up the school. Oh, she's running. She's running. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. He said, get back here, young lady. Oh, guys, guys, he's running out. The distraction worked. Okay. Okay, guys, it's go time. I'm going in here. I'm going to start looking for the keys. Let's see, you guys. There's nothing over here. It doesn't even have like a key ring or anything. Oh, guys, he literally just left them right here on his desk. Okay, guys, I've got him. I've got the keys. I've got the keys. I am running. Here we go. Now all I have to do is get back to Maddie and we can come back to the school. Oh, guys, Maddie got caught. I gotta put these keys in my pocket before he notices I have them. Principal Smarty said, you're getting suspended. I'm calling your parents right now. Follow me. Guys, Maddie got suspended for helping me out. Oh my gosh, this is so bad. I'm just gonna say, Maddie, I'm so sorry, guys. This whole gaming room thing was a bad idea. I cannot believe you got suspended. Wait, Maddie just whispered and said, it's okay, don't feel bad. Oh, Principal Smarty's yelling. He said, Maddie, come along now. She said, just build that game room. I'm just gonna say, oh, gee. Okay, guys, um, well, guys, since Maddie did get suspended on my behalf, that means I'm gonna have to build the best secret gaming room ever, and Maddie can check it out when she's back from her suspension. But for now, I've gotta wait till nighttime to come back to the school. All right, guys, it is 8 p.m. and I'm back at the school. It looks like everything is completely empty, but since I have the keys, that means I should be able to go into build mode. Yes, okay, okay, here we go, here we go. All right, you guys, I am in build mode and I think I'm going to put the secret gaming room right in here. There's always like already like a little hallway thing. So I'm thinking I can just put it right here and then add a basement. Here we go. I'm gonna go ahead and go down here and hopefully I've got this in the right area. If I go right here and then I'm just gonna, it needs to be small enough to still be like a secret, not get caught by Mrs. Sneeds, but also big enough for us to still play games in. So I think this is a good size. Now I just need to add some stairs so that we have a way to get down here. All right, let's get these. I think this will be good. All right, if I put these right here, there we go. All right, so now in this little corner, I can add a secret door. Here we go. Just put it right in this corner and then I'm gonna paint it to match the wall. Guys, that literally blends in so well. The only thing is this little trim down here, but it's so small that I don't even think anyone is going to notice, hopefully. Keeping my fingers crossed. Okay, I'm gonna add a little bit of a light in here just so we can see what's going on. But we still need to keep it pretty secret. So I'm actually only gonna add a candle right there just so it stays as dark as possible. All right, you guys, we can go in here. We go down the stairs and now it is for time for the fun part. Okay. All right. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm gonna go ahead and make these look like hardwood floors. We're gonna be spending a lot of our breaks in here. So I want it to be super cozy and comfortable. All right, there we go. Got the hardwood floors and I'm gonna make the walls a really light, nice, comforting color. Okay guys, I went ahead and made the room a little bit smaller because I was worried that if it was too big, we would have too much going on and it might get found out. So I think this is going to be a perfect size down here. So first thing I gotta do now that I've got it all sized out is obviously I have to add some nice couches and stuff. If we're gonna be hanging out down here, it has got to be comfortable. All right, you guys, I really love these little round couches. So I'm gonna go ahead and add 
this little round couch right in the middle of the room. And then of course, we're gonna add some chairs for if we ever have any friends come and play with our other games. All right, we got some chairs here. And back here, I'm gonna add some cabinets because this is where our snack bar is going to be. I am so excited for this. Okay, this is going to be so cute. All right, we're gonna have a little snack bar right here. And over here is the main event. Okay, I've gotta get a giant mungo TV. That is not a big enough one. All right, here we go. We got a ginormous TV that is going right smack center in the middle of the wall. And then of course we've got to add a ton of speakers. And I'm hoping since we're in the basement that this won't be too loud, but I think it'll be fine. I think it'll be fine. And we're gonna obviously need a big media stand right below the TV. I just have to find one that I like. What about something like this? Keep it simple, but we've got plenty of room for all of our little game consoles. All right, you guys. Okay, obviously I know that none of the colors are really matching up yet, but I think this is going to be an awesome room and uh oh. Guys, guys, that sounds like the school alarm. Oh my gosh, wait, maybe being in build mode triggered the alarm. I've got to get out of build mode or I'm so going to get caught. Okay, 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 I have to get out of here and I have got to hide. Okay, you guys, I am inside the school and it looks like they sent the real cops instead of the school security guard. That means I have got to hide fast. If I get arrested, that would really suck. But you guys, this is the perfect opportunity to test how secretive my secret gaming room is. So I just went inside the front door and I'm gonna go ahead and go into free cam, see if I can see out here. Oh my gosh. Officer Goody just said, hello? Who's there? Oh gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. You guys, he hasn't found me yet, but he is getting closer. The secret door is right behind this plant. He just said, show yourself. I can see his username. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, guys. I am freaking out. I'm gonna try and go a little bit lower. I don't have any lights down here yet, but that little candle is kind of illuminating everything. There he is, there he is. He just said, hello? He walked past the door, you guys. That is a good sign. He just said, hmm, maybe a false alarm. Okay, oh my gosh. He said, thank God, I wanna go back to bed. Oh, there he goes, guys, he is leaving. He is leaving the school, yes! Okay, you guys, so I mean, I guess that means that it's pretty secretive if even the cops couldn't find it. So uh, now that the cops has gone, I can get back to building. All right, I am back in build mode and after that scare, I am ready for this build to be finished. So I am gonna try and go as fast as possible to finish this game room up. Let's go ahead and make that white. I'm gonna change the material to where it's something more fun. And I know I was gonna leave these, but I think I might make these some little accent walls actually. I want this pink color. There we go. There we go. All right, now it's pink and yellow. I like that. Okay, and I'm even going to get a little rug over here because it has to be cozy if we're gonna spend all this time gaming. And I love these little heart rugs. I think it's so cute. All right, we got a little heart carpet path. All right, over here though, I've gotta start making this little snack bar. Okay, okay. Obviously we need lots of little drinks, so I'm gonna stick this right over here in the corner and then move this over. There we go. All right, now we've got a little drink counter. I'm gonna go ahead and add a little microwave. We can make a whole bunch of popcorn or mac and cheese. Oh my gosh, this is going to be awesome. We're never gonna have to go back to the cafeteria for lunch ever again. Oh my gosh, this little heart mirror matches all the other hearts. That's cute. Okay, I'm gonna add a little heart mirror and I'm going to add some pillows so we can be extra cozy. All right, you guys. And now once I add all these different colors, It'll be even cuter. Okay, there we go, you guys. Now I've got a whole little bed that's like kind of like a bed couch thing. I'm gonna move the coffee table forward just a little bit. We've got a little chair still over here. Oh my gosh, okay, it is coming along. I don't know about y'all, I think it's coming along. Okay, okay, guys, now no gaming room will be finished without a gaming console. And most of the time, me and Maddie just play on our Switch. So that is what I'm going to put in here. So let's get to building. I'm gonna put a box over here. Let's go on the sides right here. All right, all right, time for colors. Here we go, bright blue. All right, there we go. We have got our little Switch, you guys. I'm gonna go ahead and add a clock because we're definitely gonna need to know what time our class is. So I'm just gonna put a clock right over there. All right, you guys, now that we've got all the games and everything set up, it is time for the fun part. I'm gonna start adding some lights and some more decoration. And of course, I've gotta use this little heart light. It is literally one of my favorite things in Bloxburg. I think it is so cute. And because we need the vibes, 
Ooh, lava lamps, lava lamps are cool. I do like lava lamps. We'll put this up by the TV. All right, all right, here we go. Now I'm gonna add some little string lights. Oh, a salt lamp, oh my, okay, wait, I can't add it all, I can't have it all. If this room is secret enough to hide from the cops, I think we're gonna be fine hiding from Miss Sneeds, because if she found out that we had this, she honestly might beat us up or something. Oh, it's getting real bright in here though. I'm gonna have to dim some of these lights, otherwise uh, you might be able to see it from inside the school. So let's go ahead and add that. We'll make it some dark colors and like a light purple, maybe? I don't know if I like how dark that is, but okay, we'll go with that. I'm just gonna add a couple of shelves. Actually, let's do that on either sides of the clock. All right, now we're gonna get some plants in here because it has to, we gotta have, we gotta have some life in here. If we're gonna be in the basement, there's gotta be something. And, oh my gosh, yes, I can put little slippers for me and Maddie right down here because then as soon as we come in, we'll be able to put on these little slippers and then our feet won't make any sounds, which will make us even more hidden. Okay, I'm gonna leave those pink though because I think that's cute. All right, you guys, I have got some paintings and everything. Oh. My gosh, I'm gonna have to run in here to check this out, to make sure that all the lights look good and change these photos and then I might be done. Okay, you guys, the gaming room is finally done. We've got snacks, we've got games on the wall, we've got a clock to make sure we don't miss our classes. We've got a giant cozy couch with all of our video games, a giant TV and a lava lamp and everything. This place is totally decked out and it is completely secret. The only thing there's left to do now is wait for Maddie to get done with her suspension and then we can check this out and see if it actually works. All right, you guys, it has been a few days and Maddie's suspension is supposed to be over, which means she should be coming back to school today. And oh, oh, I see her, there she is, there she is. Oh my gosh, she just said, hey, Carrie. I'm just gonna say, Maddie, you are back. Guys, I still feel so bad that she got suspended. That was awful, but she is back and the gaming room is done. She said, I'm so glad to be back. She said, but most importantly, is it done? I'm just gonna say, oh yeah. And Miss Sneeze will never find out about it. I mean, it is so secret. Oh, uh oh, she said no, no way I find out about what? Um, oh gosh, gosh, I did not know Miss Sneeze was right around the corner. I, um, oh, um, uh, how much, uh, about how much we, uh, respect you and think you're so nice. <laughs> Guys, I hope she falls for this. Maddie just said, yeah. She said, ha, you two better respect me. If not for me, you would still be playing those dumb video games and end up homeless. Guys, she is still on this whole thing about the video games. Oh my gosh. Oh, what? She walked away. Maddie said the coast is clear. Let's check this thing out. All right, all right, all right, all right. No one is around, so I'm just gonna say, follow me. Here we go, here we go, guys. We are going in right this way. I'm gonna close the door behind us. I'm gonna say down here. Oh my gosh, she's already going, she's already going. Here we go, you guys. Well, what do you think? She said, OMG, it is awesome. We've got a TV. We've got a little couch. Here we go, we can lay down on it and everything. We've got snacks and drinks and a microwave and all of these speakers and lights and a clock again to keep to keep us on our school schedule. She said this is so awesome, it's so cute. I'm gonna say we're gonna have so much fun. I cannot believe we actually pulled this off. And, oh, there's the bell. It is 11 a.m. I'm gonna say uh, there's the bell. Uh, we should probably get to class. She said, hmm, no, huh? What do you mean, no? I put the clock in here for this reason, so we could still go to, we have to keep up with our classes. Uh, she said, normally I would never ditch, but it's Miss Sneed's class, and I wanna play games instead? Honestly, you know, I totally, I would have never ditch class either, but Miss Sneed is so terrible, so I'm gonna say, you know what? You're right. Okay, we are gonna hang out here and play some games. All right, I am gonna sit down. Oh my gosh, this is so comfy and all. Oh no, Miss Needs just typed in chat. She said, Carrie, Maddie, where are you two? I just saw you. Did they run off to play games again? Oh my gosh, guys, I can't believe this. Okay, I'm gonna run up here and see if I can see her username. I can, I can, I'm going back down. I'm going back down. Holy cow, holy cow. Maddie just said, uh-oh. <laughs> Guys, she's literally looking for us right now. She just said, where are you? Okay, I'm gonna go into free cam. I see her username right here. All right, here's the final test, you guys, to see if this room is 
actually secret. Okay, I can kind of see Maddie's username, but that's okay. Miss Needs is looking around. She said if those two are playing games, they're getting expelled. What? Are you kidding me? Oh, she's walking by. She's walking by. And she totally passed it. Oh my gosh. I'm just gonna say she didn't find us, guys. Miss Sneed totally walked right past the secret door, had no idea we were in here, and is freaking out, which means the secret gaming room is officially a success. A few weeks ago, I built a tiny home inside my boyfriend Dylan's house, but when I went over to his place today, I learned that he finally found it. He was not happy about the secret tiny home at all. Guys, this is crazy. I did not expect Dylan to be this mad. I'm just gonna say, I can't believe you found it after so so long. I mean, guys, I, I built this tiny home literally forever ago. He said, Carrie, have you secretly been hiding in my house without me knowing? Oh my gosh, I'm just gonna say LOL. Uh, yes, I have. And I totally caught you doing a ton of embarrassing things. He said, are you kidding me? He said, well, don't think you'll ever get away with doing anything like this again. Wait, huh? What is he talking about, you guys? He said, listen, it's impressive. You built this tiny home without me knowing. Oh, well, thank you. He said, but it will never happen again? He said, my house is my fortress and nobody is ever going to be in it without me knowing. Um, whatever you say. Uh, he just said, I'm going to the gym. Goodbye. Guys, I, I think Dylan might actually be pretty mad at me, but uh, holy cow. I can't believe it took him that long to find this. Okay, you guys, I am in a Bloxburg right now on Dylan's account while he's at the gym because after my conversation with him, I decided that it sounded more like a challenge. So I'm going to be building a brand new tiny home, except this time I'm going to be building it under. under. His, his house. house. So it's going to be even crazier than the last one. I'm gonna have way more room. And most importantly, Dylan is not going to find it. Okay, so the first thing I'm gonna need to do is delete the snowman. Why does he even have a snowman out here? I am going to build a basement. Let's see, we'll go right here. And we'll have it, yeah, yeah, we'll have it go this way under his house. We'll make like a little tunnel thing. Okay, adding a secret bookshelf door. All right, you guys, now here is where the secret part's going to come in. Cause I need this to be a door still. Cause if it was just like a trapped floor or something, Dylan could just walk out here and fall into it. And I don't want that. So I'm going to try and make this a door. I haven't done this before though. So let me change the size first before I get crazy. Okay, that looks good. Now if I get the transform tool and they bring it up. Just a little bit. Oh, there we go. There we go. There we go. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, come on. All right, now let's make it green. I need a green that matches. Let's go with this green. There we go. Camo. Okay. All right, I'm gonna make sure that it works. Come on. You. Okay, okay, this is good. Oh, heck yeah. Oh, heck yes. Guys, it worked. I didn't expect it to work on my first try, I'm not gonna lie. Back to build mode. Here we go. First thing I'm gonna do is just build a little room that will lead down in here, okay, for security purposes. So, right here in this room, I need to put a floor. This is gonna be my little security area. So, I'm gonna need a table. We don't need anything fancy, so I'm just gonna stick a little, well, I'll get a desktop at least. I'll get this little one down here. Wait a second, oh no. Okay, guys, Dylan just texted me that he is on the way home from the gym, which this actually might be the perfect time to test how secretive this is, so that kind of works out. But I need to get out of build mode because uh, there is a chance that he finds me right away, and then at that point, I would have just wasted all his time building a tiny home. So let's see if he can even find where the entrance is. All right, you guys, I am outside of Dylan's house. I just joined back into Bloxburg on my account, and Dylan is home right now so i'm gonna head into the backyard without him knowing and enter my little tiny home area oh oh gosh oh my gosh you guys i literally left it open guys this could have ruined the whole thing come on let me close it let me close it and i also forgot to put lights but for now i mean i still have my little computer thing and i put some cameras throughout his house so that i should be able to monitor him if he doesn't see where this tiny home door is and i 
think we're good. So I'm gonna go ahead and get on the security cameras. Okay, there's a bedroom. I'm gonna see where he is. Okay, yeah, you can see it here. It's kind of glitching, but guys, I don't know. This might not work. This might not work. It's fine. It's fine. I'm gonna try it. I have no choice now. Oh, oh, Dylan, there's Dylan. He's in the kitchen. He's in the kitchen. Okay, you guys, I'm gonna go ahead and put in chat and I'm gonna tell him to come into the backyard. Hey, Dylan, come into the backyard. I have something to show you. All right, you guys, he's obviously going to be suspicious since he was already mad at me about the other tiny home. So once he comes to the backyard, he'll look around and if he doesn't find anything, we're home free. Okay, he just said, huh? All right, all right, now I gotta get to the backyard cameras. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Oh, okay, okay, I can see this right here. Oh wait, I see his username a little bit. Oh, there he is, there he is. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, he's right next to the door. <gasps> okay, he said carry. Guys, I'm literally just not gonna say anything, but he hasn't noticed the ground yet and I haven't even gone to fix the floor, so. Oh, he said, are you out here, guys? He's looking up right now, which is really working in my favor. He said, hello. Guys, he has no idea that I am literally directly underneath him right here. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, okay. He said, huh, that's weird. Guys, he's, he's leaving. He's leaving? <laughs> Okay, now that I have set up the first part, I've made sure the door works and I'm gonna make it even more secretive. Now, it's time for the next stage. All right, guys, after looking around for a while, Dylan finally went back inside, but I do need to start building again because I don't even have a house yet. I was just testing the door. So I went ahead and I hired an actor to play Dylan's friend Poke. And so he's gonna come over and try to distract him. Okay, okay, here's my camera right at the front door and I can see Poke's username right through the front door. So that means Dylan should be there any second. Oh, there he is, there he is. Okay, okay, oh my gosh, come on, please. Hopefully he can get Dylan out of the house. Poke said, hey D, what's good? Wanna hang out today? <laughs> okay guys, this actor is pretty good. That definitely sounds like something Poke would say. Dylan said, hey Z, no, nah, I'm kinda off. I'm feeling kinda off today. I think I'm just gonna stay home. No, 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 no. Come on, he needs to leave the house, otherwise I can't keep building. Poke said, bro, you can't stay home when you're feeling like that. I know just what you need to make you feel better. Beach day. Oh yes, yes, let's take him to the pier. Way, way, way far away from his house. Come on, come on, please, Dylan, go. Dylan said, maybe you're right. Some sun might do me some good. Yes, yes, it would. It would be good to get out of your house far away. Poke said, woohoo, let's go. Okay, come on, come on, just leave the house. Shoo, oh, he just picked Dylan up and started running. Okay, I mean, that's one way to do it. Now I can start building. Okay, you guys, I am back in build mode and in order to make this build even crazier than the last tiny home, I am going to make the entire front part of a house underground. First thing I need to do is extend this basement. I have to make a big hallway. All right, this will be my big tunnel. And over here is where we will have the whole tiny house. Okay, there we go, there we go. Okay, I think I have it. I think I have it right here. Now I'm going to go ahead and add a floor. Boom, big floor, that's what I'm talking about. Okay, here we go, here we go. Now I'm gonna add some windows. Let's see, what do I want the front of my house to look like? Oh, these are cute. I got little bay windows. Only one on the other side. There we go. Oh, this is gonna be cute. <gasps> this is gonna be so cute. Wait, what? Get out of town. All right, so now that I've got the front area kind of figured out, um, I'm gonna go ahead and go inside and do some type of layout in here. So I'm gonna want a multiple rooms. This is going to be a full-blown house. Let's see, we gotta have at least one bedroom. So we'll give myself a little bedroom right here. And I want it to be connected to the bathroom. So we can make this side of the house, honestly, the bedroom area. And then in here, we'll do open concept, have kitchen over here, kitchen table, and, oh, living room, perfect. Okay, here we go. So let me get some cabinets, just so I have a good idea of where these are going to go. But it's just me in here in this little tiny home, so I don't actually have to have it be that big. There we go. And then, just so I have a good idea of where things are gonna go over here, I'm gonna go ahead and add a table. Let's go with this one right here in the little breakfast nook. And then I'm going to have, I've been wanting to use this big sectional item, you guys, so now I finally have a reason. And I'll make it a little L-shaped too. How cute, how cute. Ooh, I could do a whole big one. I like that, we're doing a whole big one. 
I honestly, I might be able to just live down here full time if I wanted to. Okay guys, so I just started filming because uh, Zach wanted to hang out randomly and he is acting very strange. He just said, yo D, thanks for hanging out. Beach day and the homie is literally just like running around the water right now. Okay, I'm gonna say, uh, dude, were you just bored or something? Like, I'm not gonna lie. I kind of just wanted to like chill at home and relax. Something feels off right now. He just said, uh, yeah, let's play mermaids. And <laughs> what the heck? Bro, why is homie just swimming around? Okay, dude, Zach and I hang out, but we definitely do not just, you know, like have, you know, two bros come hang out at the beach together. That's usually not the vibes. He said, come on, D. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say, dude, what is going on? You never want to hang like this. Normally we just go over to Zach's house and like play pool, you know, like watch TV or something. I don't know what this is. He just said, what? No way, bro. Bro, I love hanging. This man is acting so strange right now. Okay, you know what? Honestly, y'all, because I have like a sneaking suspicion that something's going on, honestly, let me just confront him about it and see what happens. He just said, let's talk. How have you been? I'm gonna say, Z, what are you hiding from me? If he tweaks right here, I'll know something's up. He just said, uh, nothing, bro. Just vibes. Okay, guys. There's something I want to check. He just said, invite me to your fam, a piggyback ride. Bro, Zach is acting so weird, guys. I don't know what on earth is going on, but... Wait, 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 guys. Right here, why does it say poke parentheses King Alfred? Wait, 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 wait. This is a different account. Wait, you're not Zach. Oh my God, guys. Uh, this fake Zach tried so hard to get me away from my house. Oh my God. The real Zach must be pulling a freaking prank on me. Okay, I am getting the heck out of here. I will not be fooled. He just said, wait, no. Oh, I'm going to expose whatever the real Zach is planning. All right, you guys, I have been in build mode and I've added a couple of things like to the bathroom and a bed, finished out the kitchen, but I have a very big problem because Poke just texted me that they are on the way back and that Dylan knows something is going on here. So uh, I have to get out of build mode right now and hide. All right, you guys, I'm running back this way. I've got to find where I put the door. I almost hit it too well because I uh, I don't know. I don't know where the entrance is. Oh, oh, wait, I think I see. Oh, yes, right here, right here. Okay, okay. All right, there we go. There we go. Okay, I'm going over here to the cameras. I still haven't added lights in this little tunnel, but that's okay. Okay, I'm going to view the security cameras. I seem to see. Oh, is it Carrie? Are you here? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh, Dylan's back at the house. Oh, where'd he go? Where'd he go? Oh, there he was. There he is. Oh, I see him kind of in the corner over here. Oh, there he is. He said your little fake wasn't very good. Wait, guys. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Wait, guys, as long as he doesn't find me, he can know something's up. He can just not know exactly what I'm doing. Oh gosh, he's running still. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? I lost him. I lost him. Oh, I see his username. Guys, I should've added more camera ads. Oh, there he is, there he is. He said, whatever kind of prank you're trying to pull isn't gonna work on me, so you might as well just come out now. Oh my gosh, you guys, wait, but he hasn't found me yet. So he actually might be wrong. My prank might be working. Wait, guys, where did he go? Oh, guys, guys, he's in the backyard. He just said, Carrie, he is right by the door right now. Oh my gosh, you've got to be kidding me. Please don't find me. Please don't find me. I've already put in so much work to my tiny home. He just said, hmm. He said, I guess she's not here. Oh my gosh. Yes, yes, he didn't find me. Oh my gosh, okay. Guys, I didn't get discovered, but um, if he already feels like something's going on, he's going to be way more cautious than he was before. So I'm going to have to change my game plan if I want to finish this build. All right, guys, I'm on Dylan's account in build mode and I am doing this in the middle of the night while Dylan is sleeping because then he won't be able to get suspicious or anything. Really quick before I continue on the inside of the house, I'm going to go ahead and make a little front yard for myself. So like, we're gonna go to gardens. Here we go. The guys, this is about to be so fun. Okay, let's do little stepping stones and let's get some planter boxes. This is gonna be cute, you guys, come on. And then if I'm living down here, I can grow my own food. It'll be like living off the grid. This is probably the first time that I've used a lot of this gardening stuff and I'm actually so excited. This is gonna be so cute. Let's get a little fountain going right over here. And then we'll, oh my gosh, wait, I can add a little trellis. Get out of town. All right, I'm gonna add some orange trees. Guys, this is gonna be like a little orchard. Guys, I'm from Texas. Y'all know I gotta add a cactus. Guys, I've literally got a whole 
like farm going down here. And now we will get some lights. All right, here we go. We're gonna add some string lights. Add some over here too. All right, I think I've got the front done. So now I'm just gonna go ahead and I'm going to make the color of my house. I've always kind of wanted a little yellow house. That could be fun. And it is gonna be dark down here. So it'd be nice to have a, like a bright little, little house. Okay, throughout the whole house is going to be hardwood floors. Color, dark brown. <gasps> Wait guys, my little, it's gonna be like a little cottage. It's gonna be so cute. All right, so first thing I gotta do is paint these walls. Let's see, I want them to be nice and calming. So we're gonna go with like this color. We're gonna make it uniform through the whole house so that the whole house feels bigger. All right, guys, the house is already looking a million times better even just after doing that. Okay, so I've pretty much got everything I need in the house. I guess I could add like a couple of nightstands. Nothing crazy, I'll just stick one over here. All right, now all I have to do is paint everything. Okay, here we go. Let's see, I'm gonna have my bed. My bed can be pink. Everything else in this house is like a yellow. Actually, it's kind of fall, so maybe I should make it like a fall color. Very nice, okay. We go, I'm gonna add a big area rug. Awesome, everything's matching. Okay, there we go. So far so good. We can add a little pattern to it probably. If I can find one I like. Okay, I'm just gonna change the color of these pillows to fall colors. Y'all can tell I'm ready for fall. Okay, now that everything is like uniform, it's it's looking, it's coming together. It's coming together, I got scared for a second. So now I just have to add some lighting. You guys know I have to add candles. All I ever want in life is candles. Okay, you guys, I think I did it. I think the tiny house is finished. And just in time, cause I am getting sleepy. Okay, it'll be time to test out in the morning. All right, you guys, it is morning now and it is time for my official tiny home tour. So I just have to sneak back here into my tiny home. Dylan should still be inside. Just have to find the entrance again. Oh, right here, right here, I think. There we go. All right, here we go. I'm going in and I am going to give y'all the best tour ever. All right, you guys, we have an entire garden. I've got all of my little vegetables and everything, my water feature, some corn, some oranges, cactuses, and my little entryway. Okay, here we go into the house. I don't have to worry about all these windows and the privacy because I am literally underground right now. So I have got a whole kitchen over here, fully functional with a stove and a sink into the bedroom. The bedroom gets a little snug, but that's okay because I have a whole little window area. I've got a giant bed, got my bathroom, my tub, my shower, literally everything. I have a window, but there's nothing to look at because I am underground, so no worries with privacy there either. And the best part about this whole house is that Dylan has no idea that I am directly below him right now. So uh, since he's never gonna find my tiny home, I might as well mess with him. Guys, I'm gonna run over here to my cameras and I'm going to see what he is up to. Okay, here we go. I just have to see, oh, I see his username. Come on, oh, oh, there, why is he just dancing in his living room? What the heck is he doing? Is this what he does when he's by himself? Okay, you guys, I'm so gonna mess with him right now. I'm just gonna say, uh, hee hee, uh, nice dance moves. Oh, oh, that just freaked him out. Oh, it just freaked him out. <laughs> he said, what, Carrie, are you looking in my windows? Oh, there he is, there he is, he's coming to the front door. <laughs> but there's nobody out there. Cause I am literally right below him right now. Uh, Dylan, you're not gonna find me. Oh, I can see him looking. Oh my gosh, you guys. He just said, Carrie, I will find you. Oh my gosh, okay, you guys. I don't want Dylan to get too suspicious. He's freaking out right now. So before he starts looking more, I am going to uh, go ahead and log off. But for the time being, my tiny home is a 